girl, you can't be fed up. No girl is with the left and the right, uh. No girl ain't like the best thing is nice, y'all. Yeah. What is going on guys, Son of Beast here. This is game six of the Sixers versus Miami Heat. As so far right now, the Bucks has won against the Raptors in game five. Then it is the Lakers pick up the win in game five against the Houston Rockets. And then the Mavericks win the second round against Utah Jazz in game four. But this game's still going. Sixers and Heat are are battling with each other to find out who will win the whole game. But it's nothing what we have to do if there's a lot more to get things done. So, who do you think will win in game six? And, and then game seven, it might be tough enough if the Sixers wins the uh, whole game against the Heat, then they move on to the next round in the Eastern Conference matchup. If they don't, then Miami Heat are back in its place in Game 6, and then Game 7, it will be really tough to find out what is happening. So, this is at American Airlines Arena, and this is going to be a toughest night matchup as we are seeing some biggest to baddest. Good evening and welcome to tonight's presentation. Of Here it is right now. Miami Heat with the finishing of in game six in Miami. But it's going to be very tough to call which team will win. Clark Dog and Anthony, Greg Anthony with Kevin Arlen. Here's DA on the sideline. Well, ben Simmons was the top rated player in high school and in college. The fractured bone in his foot cost him his first NBA season. He said a lot of people forgot about me. You have to build yourself up again. And for me, I wanted to prove myself again. Kevin, we all agree, he's done just that. Ben Simmons definitely has played in high school that time, and then he played in college in LSU. We're going to break in the action now. Let's take a look at the East and how the teams are stacking up. Let's, let's, let's find out what's happening with this game of Game 6 in the NBA second round game. But it's not totally enough to get things, to get everything back in the, into normal. So in the meantime, it's, uh, it's Game 6. Sixers lead 3-2. to two. But we need to find something out. If game necessary, then we'll be game seven. And if not, then the Sixers wins the whole game against, uh, wins the series against the Heat. So here we go. Let's get started off with game six and see who can face off against Milwaukee Bucks. Then it's Robinson. Then there's Jimmy Butler. Butler finds my nine with the shots. Good assist by Butler. Does that matter as much as people think? Or is it six thirty-five left? I, I still think it matters to the players. I mean, they're a little less. Still involved. finding a man looking for a right open shots, but it might not be too loose. A little more practical. I think it's most. Going back to Simmons. Now he just saw the Harris. And so it's the Heat getting on the board first. Six to shoot. With the shot for Harris. Oh, shot goes in. He makes the he makes the three. Wow, he, I thought that shot was supposed to be the two, but it never tied it up recently. That was a shot. Oh, and Joel and B takes it away. Here's the fast break. He passes it down to Simmons. He lost the ball. It turns the other way. Butler are going for the three in a corner. Flutter up and off the target, no good. This game coming after a loss against the Pistons. Joel Embiid went out of bounds. It's covered by none. Well, those two teams are tough, and they're really hard to face them about to a lot of games here. They lost against uh, Miami in the regular season, but this time they already lost against the, uh, the Heat at Miami, game three and four, but we don't know what's going to happen in game six. Richardson, and it's dumped in over, right behind by Adebayo. Fellas, that's what can happen. Absolutely, Greg. That makes the turnover even more painful. Well, that's a lot of painful here, but for the Heat, they're they're like having a hard time. They want to go face up against the Bucks and see how they've done. Uh, it's still Heat ball. Josh Richardson stepped out of bounds. 
5.15 left. 5 to 2 to score as the Sixers lead by 3. Jones Jr. finds none. Here's none. Screen out of the bio. Kicks off to Robinson. Going back is none. Five to shoot. Fives to shoot. Here's a shot. Loading for 13 is good. Making two attempts more even dangerous than ever that they have. Richardson going around Robinson. Oh, he waited. He landed in. Didn't see that one coming, but he definitely got it in. Four points for Richardson. Right over Jones Jr. So far. And you know what? They're going to keep using He'll be the centerpiece of their offense today. You can 440 left. Dunn looking around, made two attempts with the shot. Screen on Jones Jr. None up, gets it in the shot, makes it again. Simmons going back the other way. Simmons pass Harris. Pass to Horford. Richardson for three. Hey, it trains it in, assist by Horford. He's got seven. That's uh, seven points for Richardson, assist by Horford. With the first assist of the game. None past the Butler. They're demonstrating what they're doing. The alley oop, and there it is. Jones Jr.'s got his first bucket, too. Two assists for Butler. Simmons looking around. 3.45 left. Here's Richardson outside. It's covered by Robinson. Richardson going back to Simmons. Up and over is a Joel Embiid. Adebayo against Embiid. Screen on Embiid. Here's Hillis. The foul going on and none. On His first two shots, coming up. two shots is coming up for Tobias Harris. Unfortunately, one of each players may need something, may, may need some more players that could do it better. But when first, uh, since first um, Tobias Harris played with uh, he, he first started playing with the LA Clippers with uh, with Patrick Beverly and other and other players. His official might be saying that Tobias Harris needs has more of effort ability since we since we missed him a lot. But in that case, it was just amazing to see the uh, a new players coming back on the court. A lot of speculations going on each each team at a time. But Tobias Harris, he knows everything. What he needs to do, look for something that's good, a great shot, and a pass. Harris made two free throws. Has five points, 3.30 left, 12 to 8 to score, Heat trailing by four. Butler outside, with the three, he missed it from outside. No shots for Butler at that time again. And he passes off to Simmons. Simmons with the drive. There's a foul going on. Tragic. His first, second team foul for my for Heat. Look at Ben Simmons, and it's easy to compare him somewhat. To the I think his comparison might be a little bit untouched for uh, for Simmons than uh, than Tragic. I think what he needs to do is uh, keep an eye on the ball and shoot uh, shoot the right timing at the free throw line. But for Simmons, he's going to find out what he's going to be what he's up to. He first made the free throw. Adebayo is checked out. He's been moved so many Warford, Harris, and Richards, Richardson are subbed out. Fiebel, Robinson, the third, and Scott are checked in. What should be the prime? Butler and Adebayo are checked out. As all five are checked in. Crowder, Hero, Ibuda, Olenek, and I just, and like I just said, Drogic. Kelly Olenek checked in for Bam Adebayo. And it's Iguodala in for he didn't make the second one in for Simmons, but only one free throw allowed him to score. Hero against Robinson the third. He first had an alley oop that made the made the last couple of seasons that he did. He was doing really well with the shot and the three pointer. Drogic no good with the drive, and as Embiid will catch his third rebound. Now here's Embiid going over to Simmons. Back to Embiid. One of each players are scoreless, gets got started already. Back to Simmons. Right over Crowder. 
On to another shot, and that's three points for Simmons. No secret. This is a part of his game that's. There are no secrets here about the uh, dishing over to Fievel because how that happens, there might be a lot more that need, that they need to compete. this one, following the loss to the Hornets. Dragic against Simmons. Two twenty-three left. Dragic finds Fievel rolling over to Olenek. Olenek against MB. Defense is right there. Iguodala against Robinson the third with the shot. Olenek driving forward, no good. Philadelphia leading by seven. Two minutes left to go in the first period. As Fievel on the other hand was on the corner. I mean the wing. He passes back to Robinson the third, rolling it over to Simmons. Shoots over Dragic. Shoots over Dragic. Simmons will be never miss look. Usually, guys, he's going to knock that one down from one of each players that have a hard time, time scoring. Uh, we got a turnover for uh, Ben Simmons to block that pass. Here's two for Embiid, and then Sixers are putting it away by nine. The energy steps, how the hustle game. First bucket for uh, Embiid. Well, I think the defensive aggressive. I think Heats are trying to. Uh, I think the Miami Heat fans are trying to make sure they wanted to win the cup. But what happened here? There's a lot more that needs to be done. Hero with a dunk, assisted by Olinick. First assist. Hard not to get motivated, GA, right when you're teammate makes that kind of play. Just a minute left. Simmons passed the five ball. Hero's got his first basket of the night. Pass to MB. Overhead pass to Scott. Grabs the ball. Gets away from the paint. Simmons takes the three. Wide open look is good for Simmons and that's six points. Assist by Scott. Yes. The big lead. Yeah, you know, they've had the right, right from here, right from the shot clock when it almost went down to zero before violating the call on Philly. But that was really close. He made it that time. 35 seconds to go. 32 seconds. Olinick with the shot and three. Olinick missing again. Robinson and Ferg going back the other way. They're getting tired right now in the game five, but they didn't start in game one yet. And in game two, they never got a chance to do it yet. Game three and four, they're working really good. Over Hero, and there is the foul on Hero. His third, third team foul for Heat, and the first personal foul will be on Hero. Five ball will go to the line to shoot two. The 76ers shooting their fifth and sixth free throws of the game. Fifth and sixth free throws of the game for uh, for Philly. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. Telling Hero to uh, to watch the man's on on each corner on the uh, on the half court shot. Five hole hits the first free throw. Robinson the third and Simmons are checked out. Milton and Korkmaz are checked in. I know Burks is checked in. And then on the other hand, is Iguodala, Hero and Crowder subbed out. Iguodala switched to shooting guard. Silva and Leonard are checked in. And two free throws is in for a Bible. Nine seconds left. Dragic trying to look for the buzz beater. And here's Dragic. Dragic going to make the buzz beater. And the last Went too soon. That's the end of the first quarter. 22 to 10. Amazing start for the for the Heat, but the Sixers are doing really well. Try to get back into the game. Second quarter is up next after this. It never occurred to me that I'd be shooting threes at this rate and doing some of the things that I'm doing, but um, it's just the way that the game has evolved. Because of Al Horford, he knows what is evolving in this game. You can't, you can't just say, "I have a bunch of games and I want to get going back in." You just gotta prove yourself and have more power to, that you need to do. But we start with the second quarter. Milton past the Burks goes right from the uh, box. First rebound will go up by Leonard. Well, the offense is clicking, and they seem to have seized the momentum here early on. Yeah, you know, I shot for Iguodala is good. Came in on five. Field goal updated. Built a nice lead. 
And now let's check out the lineups courtesy of Gatorade, all fueled up. And Burks coming in the paint. The drive is good. He showed up doing really well, but Burks, Simmons, both of those two guys are doing really well. But for Embiid, it's checking really well. Here's David Aldridge on the side. David. Jimmy Butler has made several all-star teams, but he remains single-minded in pursuit of his bigger goal. Butler said, I just want to win a championship. That's all that matters. I didn't do it in high school, didn't do it in college. If I don't win it here, then I'll go to the 50 and over league someday. But I gotta win a championship at some stage. Kevin? I like that attitude. Thank you, DA. Thank you, DA. Chris Silva grabs his first by a reach and foul. Scott and Embiid are checked out as Horford and Harris are checked in. Over some of the and then on the other hand is Josh, all five players are subbed out. Great basketball, excellent pass. As Leonard moves into the center. Also, um, creativity on your move. One of the things that really Going back is though, Harris. Is the ball pop. Milton rolling over to Korkmaz with the drive. First two bucket for Korkmaz is good. Is able to follow that ball and yes. the anticipation just kind of rises as it gets to the designated shooter. Um, I love guys going after rebounds on Just the Just down to 530 left. None against Burks. Leonard with the screen. It's tipped away. Burks got a ball. Five on three break. Milton outside. Another shot's good for, for the Philly. Milton's got his first bucket of three right from outside. Assist by Burks. So far. I mean, just the kind of execution you want. What a nice play this is. Miami with the ball. None pass to Silva. Pass it over to Robinson. Robinson going in. None. Screen on Leonard. Oh, didn't, we, didn't work right. Butler outside. Three seconds to shoot with the shot. Fires from deep. Missed off the target. No shots for Butler once again. leading by 15. Oh, and Harris slams it in. Great deep pass. That was a deep pass by Horford. His second assist. Quarter two and just under two and a half minutes gone by. None going back the other way against Burks. Pass to Butler. To the Rolling in is Leonard. Leonard, Leonard, first shot's good. Third assist by Butler. Four twenty left. The interior defenders with their work down low. Thirty-one to sixteen to score. Milton, Milton outside. He's something quick here. Three minutes of action so far in the second quarter. Oh, it's blocked. It's it's recovered by Horford. That was a block saving by Leonard. Here's Korkmaz. Again, a shot's good. Right over Butler. Here's none. He has six. 350 left. They need a good offensive possession. None against Burks. 345 left. The foul will go on Burks is first. On with that call. There were no timeouts to go right now on the on the board. Then we'll go to the free throw line to shoot two. His first trip to the free throw line for two. That's a solid number to work with on the season. And they've increased their percentage quite a bit since last season, guys. Of course, his last season might be always too much. But I think that might be a better time if we can do it that one again. Two shots, four done. That free throw. Mm -hmm. The first free throw didn't work it's right. Turnover in the Philly front Richardson's office, checked in for Burks. All, some bold moves. Yeah, I'd agree with that, guys. First, the process. And then it's so Jones Jr. subbed in by Silva. And Leonard is checked out. And Bam Adebayo is checked in. drastic rebuild in NBA history, at least as I can recall. The new leadership in Elton Brand, who's done an outstanding he made a, job. He made the second free throw. Ships into the middle to go for it. Now he finally got one in. Not sitting back. In the second quarter, here's Robinson, Richardson. And that's what Richardson passing the court miles, covered by Butler. Taking a look at his stance, he's averaging around nine and a half points. Moving it over to Horford. Passes to Milton. Milton to the drive. 
The shot is good. Middleton's got five points. Three assists now. Three assists for for Horford. Already. The Heat trail by 18. Heat trailing by 18. They need some shots to get back in. Here's none. He had an 18-point outing in the last game. Here's nine. Trying to find a way to look. And the foul. Cole Region Cole. fouls going on. Quirk miles. That is his first foul. First personal foul. A different look for Miami. Jake Crowder comes Simmons in and, and Robinson and further checked in as Richardson moves to the shooting guard. Robinson's checked in. And also Miami is making some switch. Simmons Robinson and Butler are checked out. Crowder and Hero are checked in. Adebayo on the wing. None taking the three off the hard. Six on the shot clock. Oh, gonna try to pick on it. Crowder for three. Another miss for Crowder, and there is no way what he can do. Master Horford, 76ers moving the ball around. Simmons going back the other way. Here's Simmons. From the wing. Trying to free himself up. No the shot there for uh, for Simmons. 2.30 left. He'll bring it up for the Heat. They trail by 18. Defeated There's, by the Once again, they're trailing game. by 18. They'll try to put that one We're just in against none. Here's none. Richardson cover. None passes. None a hero. The freeze off wide. That time either. 2.10 left. Leading by 18. Harris with Harris going over to Simmons. Point outing in their last game against Detroit. Simmons dishes to Two minutes left to game. Richardson grabbing the shot. They made two more shots, and they're, and they're extending the lead by 20. They've been able to get these good looks. Simmons got another assist. A minute 50 left. Minute and 50 left. None trying to look around. Here's none. Guided by Simmons. Pass to Adebayo. Pass to Adebayo with the drive. He's off on that one. Off. On the Another the off way. miss for, uh, for Adebayo. Up the Pacers. 130 Six left. Three game homestand with that game. After the Sixers played against the Pacers, they have Pastor gone Robinson. way off the target here. One, one of each shots for uh, for five belt. Um, and we're missing out. Uses the glass to finish the DJ lane. McConnell. Simmons got eight points. Simmons has got eight He's points in the game. Inside. I mean, you forget sometimes that Simmons is 6'9", six, 6'10", six, with nice touch. It's a nice combination near the basket. Well, he have gone three or seven shooters. He are going three of us, ten shooters. So again, when he gets ahead, I'm checking over by Horford. Feel sorry for defenders. Ben Simmons. Another miss. He finally has one. Jones Jr. has got his second bucket. At times, be unstoppable. And Philadelphia decides to take. Brad Brown decides to take the turn. Timeout. Fifty-six point three seconds. Coach sees a lot of players are going all over the court here for the Sixers, but the Heat are trying to are trying to get back in to score another. New changes here for the Sixers and Miami. Really been a key Let's take a look at Drogic's score. Only 14, 17 at a time, but one of his game may be too much to get to get his control done. When Drogic needs to get things to get the things done, he has to do it. It's rebounded by Crowder, his first. A first rebound. Crowder trying to look for the shot as he making a, another miss. Crowder with the layup. And the shot's good. Crowder's got his first points of the That's night. That's his first point bucket of the night. Philadelphia leading 32 by seconds. Philly leading by eight. 18. We've got 28 seconds left in the first. Richardson eight. outside. 25 seconds to go. To Rolls over to Feibel. Shots off. And B grabs the rebound. He's guarded by Adebayo. 15 seconds to go. Robinson again. Down to five on the shot clock. Philadelphia needs to get With a shot. shot for Scott. Went out of bounds. No shot made. Heat ball. Olenek checked in for Crowder as Hero is checked out. Iguodala moves into the shooting guard position. Seven seconds. Five seconds. Trying to make a shot. Here's a shot. 
The three-pointer's off the line. First half has come to a close, 39 to 21. 18 point, 18 point lead for Sixers, but the Heat are trying to get back in. They need to, to get to the blowout. Now stand by by David Aldridge on the sideline. David. Kevin, thanks. Coach, what is your impression of the first half? Didn't play. I thought we found a really good balance of posting and pace. It's what we've been talking about. And uh, I thought our defense, for the most part, was excellent. A good start. We'll see how they finish. Thanks, Coach. Back to you, Kevin. Thanks, DA. We'll, we'll be back in the second half after this of the halftime show. Well, the Heats are trying to get back into your back into your action, but they're ready to start the second half. As for uh, as for Josh Richardson, making some steals here. By that moment, we are just not complaining about Josh Richardson. He's doing a, a, a tremendous job here, but he but he has to get back in and try to be careful of what the players are up to. When we dive in, we got to keep it going. First half has been complete. Now let's start the second half. Harris against Butler. Simmons, Richardson, Harris, Horford, and MB. MB going in. Comes up heavy, but that's an Abayo's solid D. Everything that needs to do. Oh, the alley-oop's good. Nunn's got, it. Nunn's got another assist after the score by Jones Jr. Passing around already. They're doing really good. Looping up is MB going back to Richardson with the shot. A rebound it. What a solid D going on, Jones Jr. Just flat out trick that one. Missed flat out trick, nothing to happen again. But himself. Robinson passes. To Robinson Martin. passing it done. He are looking for another shot to come up. And he will cause his first personal foul. Dunn will go to the line to shoot two with just 603 remaining. It really resonated with me, Kevin. I'm really getting a little bit annoyed of what just happened with that game. You know, most there, Eric Spolstra, only the head coach from the, uh, from the Heat, and Brett Brown from the coach from, uh, from the Philly uh, Sixers. They're both having some hard time uh, not picking, not looking for an open offense to keep up with. Of age, and having them encourage me to keep going and that I'd have a chance to... The first free throw was off the mark. Time, ...which was play pro ball. Good on the, the second free throw made it in. At the same time just happened in the first half, but the second half so needs to get better. Six minutes to go. Harris covered by Butler. Pass to Will Richardson. Going for a motion. Back to Harris. Back to Harris. Over, over Butler. The good look with the inside as Harris got nine points. Finally. Finally got number one, but no missed shot made for Harris. Robinson passed to none. None going inside. Fade away off the arc is good. Ten points in the game for Kendrick Nunn with no shots uh, missed. Fast bounce pass to Orford. Gets away. Simmons with the look. Wide open look for Simmons is good. Way through. Four assists now tonight. Four assists will be Al Horford. And Simmons draft dragging the floor up by 11 points. The Heat trail by 18. Heat still trailing by 18. Here's Nine to drive. Shots off the mark. Good D by MB. Good D by MB. Kevin, but overall they're getting slightly out rebounded. And that's a good place to start if you're going to try to find your... Al Horford shot went off and B grabs another rebound. What a nice rebound this is for MB. the miss by Al Horford. Shot clock at six. Bounce pass looking over. Reach and foul going, going on Jimmy Butler, his first. His first the game. New changes are on the court for, the for Sixers, Sixers and Heat. Richardson and Harris are checked out. Burks and Cork Miles are checked in. And Bede on the outside. Rolling over. And 
Silva grabs his second personal foul. Almost went out loose already. But for Jimmy Butler, he's helping out Silva not making mistakes again. They need someone to cover in in the paint. Maybe I should get out of this stuff. And B will grab two free throws of the night. Now we see his first trip in the second half. This is what happens already. When the players draw the foul, it's on you. And some real adversity for Joel Embiid. Milton checked in for Simmons. Injuries costing him the first Burks switches to the point guard career. position. And then, back in Cameroon, the tragic passing of his beloved brother. Yeah, that's a hard road to hoe, and adversity oftentimes, while painful, can steal us for the promised land or positive outcomes. And, you know, Embiid, really driven by his goal to inspire others in Africa to make a better life, and that drove him to be where he is now. Here's none. None. Only had 10 points. Robinson. No screen on Leonard, but it looks like he is. Pass the nun on the outside, covered by Burks. Shot for Butler. Another miss, and he's missing the game too many times. 15 for uh, this Philly, and 8 for Miami. Strong rebounding has certainly been at the Passing over the court, boss. But it's been good on a number of levels. With a drive. Shots off. Leonard with a rebound. I'm a fan. And Butler coming in, grabs a rebound, shots good! Burks got his second personal foul, and that's his first bucket for Butler in the second half. He finally got one in, but never went out too soon, but he's doing really good. Trying to get back in as, as best as he can. And he keeps himself in tip-top shape. 341 left. I'm not sure the casual fan even recognizes. One shot. Just one shot left for Butler. The free throw. Butler got his first first free well, throw. They say players and that's are three three points. And that's going really well, trying to keep it back in before reaching out of trouble. Grimy season gets out in the country and Ooh, don't get ran over by a fan. Here's Bounce the pass to Cork Boss. Points in the game. It's guarded by none. Shots up, miss, and Horford. Oh my! What a shot here for Horford, and that's his first basket in the second half. Interior presence. Horford's a veteran who still has those equal against Milton. Butler on the Three minutes to go. Butler coming in with a shot. Good. And he had some number two pointer. That's five points, three assists, only uh, five missed shots. Only he made five missed shots throughout the but that's okay. He made his second shot, and not just only missed shot he made. Out of bounds, it's heat ball. Brookmont stepped out of bounds. New changes here for Philly and Heat. Al Orford and Milton are checked out. Fiebel and Scott are checked in. And in the other hand, Iguodala, Butler, Silva, well, and Leonard are checked 17. out. Olenek, Leonard, Iguodala, and Hero are checked in. Leonard moves into the point forward He's position. Some minutes, but nothing on the board yet. Nothing on the board for Leonard. The drive's good by Drogic, his first, his first basket. And savvy of Drogic. I mean, when he gets positioned deep inside, he finds Just 220 left, 48 to 33. Burns passing it up to Scott. Bible with the three. Outside, no good. Even these shots may have been really tough. Over Scott. Drogic has got his second bucket. Two minutes left. 48 to 35 to score. The D are catching up by 13. To pick up that interior defense. House pass, Bible going over to MB. Olenek. Ball loose. Olenek grabs a steal. 
139 left to play in the third. Iguodala with a wide open look. Oh, he missed again. No threes for Iguodala. And Embiid's got the ball. That's nine rebounds. 22 was their biggest lead. 22 was the biggest lead that was happening since the last couple of games. Six to shoot. It's only six to shoot. That's Mines Quirk Boss makes a three. Good! Six it in for Sky's number six. Points in the game. Twelve points for Quirk Boss. Quirk Boss got seven points. Twelve points for the game. Olenek trying to look around again. Dragic going in. Recovered. Shots good for Dragic, guys. Third for third personal foul for Burks. Great shot and a drive for Dragic, but now Burks is checked out. And Harrison uh, scoring breakdown for the 76ers. Harrison Richardson with Simmons are checked in as five ball. Who's the small forward? Iguodala, Leonard, or Lennox are sent out of bio shooting. But you can check in as a Lennox passing the basket. Switches the point forward tonight as well. One shot left for Dragic. He makes it. 52.2 seconds. 30, 51 to 38. Not the force he once was, but always. Simmons a trying to look around. Only 11 points. Same thing as Dragic did. 11 points, and that moves up to 13 points. This shooting has been. They're shooting off a way off the mark, but it looks like in this game. Ben Simmons was never played. Uh, never played up. Uh, Played high school basketball since his freshman year. Crowder shot went off. Harris got his first personal foul. Shooting free throws here for the start of the second half. Nice work to get Just pulling up some bonuses. Draw contact. And just a number of not to allow the easy layup right there. Another easy layup here for Crowder. the free throws. Maybe a number two will work. Let's see what Crowder has. And the first first shot's good for Crowder. Yes, Crowder did play with the uh, Brooklyn Nets last season, again, um, in 2018-19. But all of a sudden, Crowder's thinking that he wants to try something else. And yes, all the Brooklyn Nets fans miss Crowder as much as they as they respect him for as for as many as I do. Their aggressiveness here. Crowder or just second, despite being Oh no, it was for Utah Jazz. Carroll is the uh, another good job though of drawing contact. Carroll was in the uh, oh yes Carroll was in the, in the Rockets. Crowder's with the uh, Utah Jazz, okay. Okay, I'm getting a little bit confused, but now I do. Bible making a number two, and that's four points. And the Sixers are leading by 15. And yes, as I just said, Utah Jazz fans miss Crowder a lot. Buzz Peter off the mark, and that's the end of the third quarter. 55 to 40. The Sixers lead by 15. Fourth quarter needs to be on the strong move. A lot of terrific field goal percentage. Yep, I agree with you. Fourth quarter is up next after this. Let's have a reveal look at the State Farm assist of the game. Look at the precision. Let's look at the precision of what uh, what those players are up to. Since Quirk Miles was getting there right in time, he noticed that one of his one of his open uh, open wide courts from the forward, his shooting was not just the same thing, just like Silva has. But at that and moment, Kurt Moss and Milton were just forward, trying to uh, keep an eye out to look for looking for a man on defense. They don't want to get messed up, mashed up already. At that moment, Kurt Moss has gotten the assist of the game, and that was by Milton. Whoa, what a great deep for five ball, and not a bio shot is way off. Performance on the interior, the rebounding has been off the Simmons going right outside of the outside of three point line. Great game. I mean, strong performances through. Richardson really over, over Hero. Richardson with a missed shot again. The trail in my 15. Hero. It's blocked by Embiid. The second time. Oh, what a great block in a row for Embiid. 
Almost lost the ball. But he passed to Simmons. Back to, back to Richardson. Bounce pass to Harris. Throwing back to Richardson. Takes the shoot. Simmons up. Shots good. Heroes got his second personal foul. Yeah, show that muscle out there and make it silent. Roster. What would be your preference as a general manager? What's another roster that we can look for? Well, obviously, if you have an opportunity to get an outstanding franchise type point guard or versatile wing player in today's game, I think those are the pieces that you really need to start with. Because there's so much spacing and, and so much switching on defense. Exactly, and I failed to mention a two-way player at that wing spot All right, who yeah. can defend multiple positions but also has a pretty strong offensive skill set. One shot for Simmons is good. Well, he shot at six, 16 points. Skills Unbelievable. An incredibly unique All five players are back on the court in the starting position. None against Simmons. Going up all over it. It's nine. Nine taking that layup. It's rebounded by Simmons. What a locking position does he have going downhill. Two rebounds for Simmons. Simmons grabs to Richardson. Bounce pass. Overhead pass, MB. More of a score than a pass or a facilitator. Magic down. Shot for MB went late. The true six eight-ish point guards. He are just trying to grab their own shots of just 221 per minute. But it looks like one of each key B players are trying to get the shot. Only uh, from Joel Embiid. Only Crowder had made two free throws, but it may not be enough. What a D here! And a rejection goes up again for Embiid. 450 left. Pass to Harris. Harris passed to Embiid. And reach out a foul by Adebayo, his first. Second team foul for Miami Heat. Joel Embiid will go back to the line to shoot two. But it looks like a, looks like a play screen was just not working right. You know, guys, it looks like going up over your hand, up and over the player, and then making another shot. Like from both, like from here, two hands, right around the, uh, right around the back side of a rainbow, like over the rainbow, and then uh, going wide open here, and then with the shot. That should be the better play for Embiid. Joel Embiid hits the first free throw. And when he first came to America, you know, what a great story this is. Embiid's coach in Cameroon sent him a DVD of Hakeem's highlights. And that was a good start for Embiid. And good work by you, Kevin, to dig up that factoid. Very nicely done. But you're right. Embiid said he watched that tape every day for three years. And you can see evidence of him watching that tape. Time out going on in Miami. He's He's still waiting for fight. that first miss from the line this half. 100% since halftime? Come on now. I'm not sure this lead's going away anytime soon with that kind of marksmanship. Of course they have here. They're never going to be too surprised to see what happens already. Sixers lead by 20. A lot of pointing average is just going right away here. Making new changes is fireball and Oakland are checked in. By Embiid and Simmons. Fourth quarter of play, we're about two and a half minutes through it right now. Now we're just going to go through a three to two zone. And Jones has it. Jones has it deep. Hits the, Hits the three pointer outside as he's got his first three pointer. Sixers only made five more three pointer than the Heat. But for the Heat, they only made two. So that was not quite enough to get there. Or for it past the Fiebel. Shoots over Robinson. Shot. shot, no good. Robinson's got another rebound. You know, even though they're on only two and two, mate. You'd like him to be better. Butler missing out the drive. It sure would make things a lot easier too. Pass to Harris. Harris. Jimmy Butler unable to get his last shot to go. Harris finds Warford rolling over to Fiebel. Oakland will carry the screen. Here's Fiebel. With a shot. Fiebel, no good. Another two-pointer miss. Butler, none, going back the other way. Robinson carrying out. Adebayo calls him put back, and there it is. 
A lot of chance points are pulling up back in a row, but it looks like how the Heat fans are just going wild already. We played just over three. Five hole past the Oakway. Oakway with a draw fadeaway. The Sixers cannot find their man to go over with the shots again. Butler almost made the ball loose. That's seven points for Butler. They're heading up to buy it up on, on each player that was ever happened again. Horford against Jones Jr. Three minutes to go. Harris for three. Target off the wing, but it's rebounded by Adebayo. Heat are trailing by 13. Robinson going looking over. Butler with a three. Outside range, no good. 22 is their biggest lead. Here's O'Quinn. He's something to go over with. O'Quinn trying to find a spot open. Five ball on the outside. Shoots over Butler. And Butler calls his second personal foul. Wow, but Butler doesn't like that call. He hates it. And what happened to all that fans? They really hate with that call and no blocking save by Butler. Yeah, this is happening already. They really hate the Sixers. But for that time, Fiber will get to the line, go to the line to shoot two. 226 remaining, 60 to 47. He may not be looking too good, but it's not that hard enough to uh, get their and position the in. The so O'Quinn is subbed out. In the Joel Embiid and Ben Simmons are finished with rehydrating after uh, Richardson is subbed it's out. Five ball moves to the shooting guard for position for after Ben Simmons is checked in. And versatility, the fact that it's basically four on five when they're on offense with him on the floor is a problem in the playoffs. And you said it. And teams can they look too that time. They're going to make you do what you're uncomfortable They are with. leading it up by... The Heat trail by 15. By 15. Doing really well with the hard work. None going outside. Oh, no! Aliou went off! Unbelievable. What happened to none? Grabs the rebound by MB. Harris for three. Off the mark. Butler with the rebound. Two minutes to go. Nine trying to find a look. Butler with a three. Good. It's connected in. Assist by none. With that quarter, it never seems to show up too soon by that moment. Pass it up and beat. Double man. Simmons going back up. He missed out the three, and he has no luck to shoot the average again. Here's Jones. Oh, a block by MB. That's three. That oh no, that's four in a row for for uh, for MB. How how does he do that? Wow, he just he just got out of the way and tried to stop on Jones Jr. that time. Simmons cannot find an open three. 113 left. Robinson passing down to Bayer, rolling over to Dunn. Pass to Robinson. Flies up the three, no good. Another rebound by Embiid. That's 12 in a row. He's a monster. He's trying to blow out everything that he can do. Dunn calls his second personal foul. Fourth team foul for Miami. Heat. Eric Spolstra still having desperate talk. Wants to help the players to get better. But the players are just kicking. And too much out of time. 39 wins and a good effort tonight. And what a tremendous so, what a tremendous game for in the second round as the Sixers are heading their way to the Eastern Conference for their first time since uh, a bunch of steals. I don't know, maybe that time in a long time, maybe 1984 or something. I don't have any luck for, for this moment. A very similar story. Richardson's checked Duncan in for five ball. The Cameroon native did not start playing basketball until and it's, and then it's late tragic late. checked in now for none. One of the very best in the game. One shot left for MB. The Heat making a switch here. Trogic has checked in and the 76ers also making a change. Richardson's checked in. Two free throws for MB. It's good. 
That is four points, eight points in a row. Fifty seconds left. Finds Robinson. Shots off. Oh, what a great block by Horford. Pass up to Richardson. It's Richardson. Bernie left out alone. Looks like he can't stand it anymore. Richardson kicks to Simmons. Yep. That might be the end of it. Takes a Harris three. takes a three. That's, That's good. Assist by Simmons. And the 76ers lead by 17. They lead by 17. It looks like they finally made a win. And with Miami Heat with a rival team, it looks hard to take that one out. It looks really tough. Simmons Unfortunately, I don't have any luck to show you what is happening from here. But it looks everything is happening again with the shots. For Miami Heat, Adebayo makes a shot and a layup. 13 seconds left. All the shots went went really broken up. And it looks like nothing will happen again. And Harris will leave it out alone, and that's the end of the game in the second round as the Philadelphia Sixers advance to the Eastern Conference matchup, take on against the Milwaukee Bucks. 67-52 is your final score. That is the end of the second round of the playoffs. The third round will be the semifinals between Eastern Conference and Western Conference. Let's go to David Aldridge on the sideline. David. Thanks very much. Al, you guys do it as a five-man unit on the floor. How did you come together for this win? Uh, just taking good shots on offense, um, trying to, you know, getting stops on defense. Uh, we challenge every shot. Um, you know, just, just played hard tonight. Great effort and a big win, Al. Congrats. Back to you, Kevin. Thank you, David. Thank you, DA. Thank you guys for tuning in for the NBA 2K20 of the NBA playoffs in the second round. We are heading on its way to the Eastern Conference and a Western Conference championship game by Houston, by a by a huge win here as a huge matchup with the hardest tough matchup that you will ever face. It will be Sixers against the Bucks and. Lakers against Dallas Mavericks. By that moment, here's your Jordan player of the game. This one is out by the best player that was ever released it out, a best time that was been played. That was Ben Simmons. 16 points, three rebounds, three assists, and four steals. That was incredible what was happening by Ben Simmons after he played after he finished college in LSU, he's doing really well, trying to get back into the uh, game. And by that moment, he was the first person that was drafted in 2016. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys like to see more videos, you can check out the first round of the NBA playoffs that I did post one and uploaded the last time I did. And uh, there's going to be more on its way. Stay tuned for the uh, NBA Finals and see which team will move on to the ending of the finals. By that moment, we like to say thank you guys for tuning in and for watching. As until next time, peace out, bitches, for as well as an NBA playoff dial. See you guys next time.